Hey, this is Andrew Brown from Exam Pro, and we're gonna be taking a look at speculative plans and uh, save plans just a little bit more in detail. There's not a lot to talk about when we're talking about speculative plans because we've been using them throughout that, but we'll just contrast them against the save plans um, and just how you would actually use them with the apply. Uh, this stuff isn't super complicated, but uh, what we're gonna do is make a new file here. I'm gonna call this main.tf. And um, you know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and grab our code here from the last one to for the uh, state file there. And we'll go up and I'm just gonna rename this back to my server. And we'll save this as my server. And there's only a single instance, so I'm just gonna take out that there. I'm gonna CD back there and we're gonna make our way into the plan and apply. I'm gonna do a Terraform init and we're gonna wait for that to finish. So, you know, we've been seeing speculative plans throughout all the follow alongs and that's just where it's going to show you that information, but we can also save that uh, that plan out to a file. I don't think there's a particular naming convention for the file, it just has to be named as something. Um, but we'll give it a, a moment here for this to initialize and then we'll do that with the out command, okay? So what I'm gonna do is just type in terraform plan hyphen out and then we can give it whatever name we want. Probably it'd be good to name it like dot plan. That's what I'm gonna do here. And so I'm just going to call this um, uh, my save plan. Okay, and what that will do is output that file in a moment here. So it ran and then it outputted. If we open it up, notice that it's a binary file so we can't actually um, inspect it in any way. But if we are happy with the uh, these here, what we can do is type in terraform apply, and then we can just provide it the name my saved plan dot plan and hit enter. And so what it should do is just proceed to deploy and it won't even review, it should just deploy. At least that's what the documentation says. So hopefully it does not contradict what, what happens here. Okay, notice that it's already carrying out the, uh, the action. So uh, you know, save plans would be really great if you are setting up a um, like a tool to review. So this kind of makes sense when you're looking at Terraform Cloud and it, it applies a plan and then you proceed to the next step where you accept the apply. I would imagine that they're using that, but I guess when you're using a CI CD pipeline, that's something that would be really useful. But anyway, we're going to let this uh, finish creating. And then once it's done, we're just going to destroy it. But that's pretty much all I wanted to show you was the fact that you can use the hyphen out command to um, output that stuff. So we'll just go here and type in terraform, apply, auto approve and destroy. Okay. And we'll give it a moment there and we're all good. So I'll see you later.